Hello, in this video we will see the general interview question that is uh, how will you uh, remove the duplicate records while inserting it from source to target. Uh, actually there are tools of uh, considering the duplicacy in the records. Uh, let's say we have a table uh, staging underscore raw. So in this table if you see uh, the last two records, in these two records all values in all the three columns are same. So we can say that these two records are totally duplicated but uh, we can also uh, let's say uh, if you are in a target table we have a primary key defined on the field 1 column that is the employee id let's say. So uh, if you consider uh, employee ID as a primary key, so in that scenario, these four records can become a duplicate. So uh, these two scenarios uh, will basically verify to how we can remove uh, these duplicacy in both of these scenarios. So to start with, we will first consider the first scenario uh, that is uh, all fields in particular uh, table are duplicated. Uh, that means uh, in this example uh, field 1, field 2, field 3 all uh, three fields having the same value. So we will first see how can we remove the duplicate records in this scenario. For that we will create a simple mapping. Okay, uh, so staging underscore raw is our source table and staging underscore raw 2 is our target table. So to remove all the duplicate records is pretty much simple. You just need to add sorter transformation in between. So in sorter transformation basically Informatica gives the option to pass only the distinct record ahead means the next transformation after the sorter will get only distinct records so sorter will basically remove the duplicate records so then with the mapping creation mapping is in value state we will create corresponding workflow session task link these two tasks and we are done with the workflow creation So even workflow is in valid status, we just have to run this workflow now. So our workflow execution got completed. We'll okay, if you can see here. Uh, in 
informatica source qualifier has read five records but at the time of insertion it inserted only four records so we will verify the target so what we were expecting is one of this record one of these two record should get eliminated while inserting into the target you see at saving row okay. there must be some data exists already in that target table so what we will do is we will select truncate and reward option so before loading the data into the target it will truncate earlier records run the workflow again session got completed five records got read by a source qualifier and four records got inserted at target level will you see the records are changing row yes if you can see here now there are no duplicate records at staging row 2 that means one of these record got eliminated by sorter transformation so by this way we have achieved first part now uh, to achieve the second part that means we only have to insert a uh, distinct records for field 1 so for that reason what we will do is we will just add aggregator transformation in between as we are determining the data duplicacy based on field 1 column we will select aggregator port as field 1 as we have added sorter transformation before the aggregator we can always use sorted input We have done with the mapping creation. We will just refresh the workflow. When workflow is in valid status, we will run this workflow. If you see here, now this time source qualifier read 5 records. Whereas at the time of insertion into target level, it inserted only three records. So we'll see what exact, uh, what exactly uh, situation at target level. So as we have uh, aggregated it by field one, only distinct field one records got inserted. That is one, two, three. If you see the source tables, there are duplicate records at field one. 2 and 3 value got repeated so that basically got eliminated eliminated so this is how we can achieve uh, or we can eliminate uh, duplicacy in the record uh, in these two scenarios thanks for watching this video